Hey guys, how are all of you doing? This is your friend Mainak from Civil Center and I welcome all of you back to our channel and another tutorial on Tecla Structural Designer. So friends, in today's video, we are going to show you how to create openings in RCC walls in Tecla Structural Designer. So without wasting any time, let's get started. So before starting, I want to tell you, we have launched for you a complete recorded course on G plus 3 building design using Tecla Structural Designer in which all the aspects of your planning, structural design and making the final structural drawing sheet will be covered and in this course, we'll also include two live demonstrations and two doubt clearing sessions for you. So what are you waiting for? Hurry up and you can contact the number which has been given here and also you can register using the link which has been given in the description. So first of all, you need to define your construction levels, which we have already done. After that, you can go to a particular level and you can draw some grid lines. Let's say we'll take a parallel grid line of, let's say, you're at a distance of uh, four meters and we can simply place another grid line. So we're going to place the shear wall here. So under the model, we have the option of meshed wall. We'll just select from here to here and we'll see in the 3d view our meshed wall or the shear wall is ready now if we want to insert certain openings in this say for example for doors now how to do this so we'll just go to the frame option and then we'll go to the structure window we'll just open this particular frame here let's go to this option of construction lines we'll draw some parallel construction lines let's give it a height of your We'll press F2 and we'll give it a height of 2.1 meters and after that we'll press on escape and from here we'll just select up to this much and then from here we'll give it a distance of let's say 1.2 meters and now we can create the particular opening for your door for that you just need to select this option of your wall opening so after you select the option of your wall opening you can just pick the wall or the reference point so after you do that you'll just click on the first corner and you'll click on the second corner so after you double click you can change this particular properties this window automatically pops up you can change the type of the wall materials wall supports and also the releases so all these things you can change you can change the panel thickness here as well so after having changed all this you can just click on ok and you can view it in the 3d view so as you can see in the 3d view also the opening for your doors has been created in your particular rc shear walls so friends like this we can create openings in meshed walls or shear walls in tecla structural designer hope you found this video useful for more videos stay tuned to our channel and if you want professional training on tecla structural designer and if you want to know how to think and how to talk like a consultant how to make your designs as per the requirements of your clients you can join our full course on g plus 3 building design using tecla structural design so that's all for today's video bye bye